Welcome to today's How to Draw Things. In honor of Shark Week, we are going to draw shark, even though I recorded this when I had no clue that Shark Week was coming up. It's just fortunate. Go ahead and grab a light blue and a dark blue marker, or a gray marker and a black marker, or really if you're not picky about colors, any two colors as long as one is lighter and one is darker. You can make a pink shark. It would be cool. Alright, grab the lighter of your two markers first and draw a long line that arcs down at the end. Voila. Starting at the end there, draw another line underneath it that kind of arcs out and comes under. A diagonal line down like so. And then mimic that top curve again here, but in smaller. Kind of mimic the bottom curve again. So you have kind of the body and then the mouth and they kind of look like the same shape and then finish it all off with the diagonal line. Draw that curved shark fin. We've all come to know and fear. I think it's cool. I've never seen one in real life though, so that's probably why. And then come to the back fin. Make your back top fin pretty long, kind of like the opposite of that body curve. And then make the bottom back fin kind of an inverse, upside down version of that, and a little smaller, like so. Sharks have that big top back fin and a little fin on the bottom. Then he gets the two side fins, which are just curves in and back again. You'll see me she uses this shape a lot. Alright, you've got your basic shark body. Go ahead and color it in. If you're using markers like I am, uh, make sure you don't overlap too much. If you're kind of a messy colorer like I can be, go ahead and add that extra layer of outline in there. That gives you a little bit of padding in case your uh, lines tend to get away from you. Now, I think sharks are pretty cool creatures. They're a little scary because they're very big and they have a lot of teeth, and I, they kind of continuously grow teeth or have two rows of teeth or they have a freaky thing going with teeth. They have far too many of them. But overall, they're very cool animals. And they come in all different sizes. You can have very, very small, cute little sharks, or you can have really big sharks. And the cool thing about the biggest shark, the whale shark, which we're not drawing today, this is a normal shark shark. The whale shark is still a shark, and it's one of the biggest creatures in the ocean outside of whales, and it eats super small animals. Can't even eat a human. Couldn't if it tried. So there's just amazing diversity in sharks. And besides, when they accidentally chomp on a human, it's an accident. They thought they were a seal. I've had that happen. Not with seals and humans. Alright, grab your darker marker. Draw a big curve about halfway through the shark's body and then a couple little identical curves after it. Those are the gills. Then draw a little dot for the eye and put these kind of two little curves around it because their eyes kind of bulge out. And then do the fun part. Yeah, that's right, the teeth. Add as many as you possibly can. All right. You have got yourself one scary shark. I suggest we accessorize them and make them a little less scary. How about a funny hat? Maybe a bow tie? I think sharks overall are pretty cool, and I hope you do too. Just don't go swimming with them. Save that for the dolphins. Alright, thank you for visiting my video. Um, if you liked it, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button. If you really liked it, hit subscribe. Uh, if you want more videos, go to my website, www.how-to-draw-things.com. It's a pretty cool website. I made it myself.